Hi, I'm Rich Grandy and I'm with Durham Geoslope Indicator. Today I'm going to be showing you how to import an image into Atlas. You can use this feature to display your company logo, a project image, or most importantly a plan view image. Graphics can be resized with software that may be included with your operating system. For this demonstration, I will be using Microsoft Office Picture Manager. Other popular free software that can be downloaded from the web are Earthen View and also VSO Image Resizer. To get started, first open the software that you want to use to resize your image. Since I'm using Microsoft Office Picture Manager, I'll go to Start, All Programs, Microsoft Office, Microsoft Office Tools, and Microsoft Office Picture Manager. You'll see that it immediately displays anything that I have on the desktop. You can also browse to any pictures you want to choose right over here on the left hand side an alternate and sometimes easier method to do all of this is to just browse to the folder where the image is stored and then simply double click on it if Microsoft Office Picture Manager is already installed on your computer it will most likely be set up as your default image viewing software To get started, go ahead and open an image that needs to be resized, then click the Edit Pictures button. You will now see a menu open to the right. Click the Resize button located underneath Change Picture Size. The window will change and you will now see a new set of functions. Click the Predefined Width and Height button then click the drop down menu. Now go to document small 800 by 600 and select that. Now click the OK button and you will see right here in the setting size summary that your new size is 800 by 600. Most people want to make a plan view image the size of their monitor, which is commonly 1024 by 768. We recommend using a size of 800 by 600. This guarantees that the plan view will be completely visible and reduce the need to scroll up or down to view all of your sensors. To add your image to your plan view, log into Atlas, then click on Configuration, then Plan Views. If you are creating a new plan view, click the Add Plan View button. Name your plan view. You can add your coordinates, your X and Y axis and you can also select whether you want a small border located around your image. Now browse to your image. Ours is located on the desktop. Select it and hit the Add button. Once it has been successfully uploaded to Atlas, you'll receive this message here that says Plan View Added and you'll also see it located right here. To see your plan view, simply click the plan view button and click on the plan view you created. Your image should then appear and now you can start adding sensors to your plan view image.
To add a logo or a project image, click on Configuration and then Projects. Now click the Add Project button. A new menu will appear. First, name your project, then go over here to add your logo graphic. Click the Browse button, choose your image, and hit Open. To add a project graphic, click the Browse button. I'm just going to add our logo here again, so it will appear twice. And then click the graphic border if you want a small, thin border located around your image. Choose whether you want your graphic to appear to the left or to the center. If you do not want to add a project graphic, but would like to name it nonetheless, enter it right here in text as a project name. Down here you would go ahead and select the users that will have access to this project by choosing their name and then clicking the arrow buttons. And over here is where you would enter a description of this project. That will appear right here. Click Save. To view your new project, click the drop-down arrow Click on your project, and you should see your graphics appear. For more information, please go to www.slopeindicator.com. Thank you very much.